answers because we don't have answers. We're in charge of the spending and the budget and stuff like that. Yeah, it's but not. you're supposed to run the meeting. Speaking of spending, too. Any other questions? <laughs> so you just nope. bypass people that are continue talking? Are they done? Go ahead. I, what about the fish so fry? This is How's, going? That, how's that going to go? What's that? The fish fry. I, are you going to have it in April? You said the next fish fry? There will be one in February. And what, 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 what fish fry? When was the first fish fry they always had? April 1st. April 1st? You better talk to the chief. I know, I, know, I know he's reluctant as can be. The chief is reluctant as can be about it. But yeah, tell, tell me why you're so reluctant. Okay, please. I, right, right at this time, um, <clears throat> Everybody said April, you know, we're going to have fish fry. I'm not ready for a fish fry. I want to make sure that this department is ready to go. It's not that I don't want to have them. I just, I want to make sure that this department's ready to go. That's my concern right now. Fish fry, I know it's, I know that it's a great big, it's a town event. I know it is. Yeah. And I really want to have one. I'm looking more towards maybe October would be a good time. But right now, I want to make sure this is ready to go. That's my concern. I'm, I want the community to be safe first. Let them know why. Let the community know why we're holding on. Well, I told them because I want to make sure we're ready to go. All, All our, our trainings are done. Our, everybody's ready to go. Are, so. are, you, are you missing a lot of equipment that you used for the fish fries? Is that... No, no. All the no, fish fry no. equipment belongs to the fish fryers, San Pierre fish okay. We are a separate entity now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We are just San Pierre Fire Department. The fish fryers is separate. So if we have a fish fry, they we would have to hire them okay. to do it, just like what North Jetson does. Let me make a comment here, Chad. I talked to my course, and he said he'll order everything like he normally does for the fish fry. All you guys got to do here is get the tables and chairs back in this building. And have help here on Saturday for a one-day event to put some money back in your checkbook and everybody in this community is willing to jump in and help <coughs> the, the quicker you get this community back together you're actually if you if you do it in April you're telling the community that you're back here to support Railroad Township I'm you have a lot Rayville of people Township. that's willing to jump in and help out with the prize I, and, and I, you know, I understand where you're coming yeah. from, and I, and, I, and I know you're going to get it all taken care of. But and my feeling is to try to bring everybody back together, you know, yeah. the, the support of the whole community like we had before. <laughs> I realize it would be a little bit of a burden <coughs> with Mike taking care of all the order and everything, and the fish fryers handle all that. I think you can pull it off. I feel you. I know you can pull it off. A it good would fish just fry. be a matter of the, the building, correct? Right. And matter then the use of, of the, the kitchen? It's yeah, a well, I understand, thing. but I do have a lot of things that I'd like to get taken care of before I would even think about this right mm -hmm. at this time, and that's where I'm at. I want to be. I want to feel confident. That I don't have no issues. Let me see where I'm at later on in the year, February, late middle of February, next somewhere month. in there. So well, if you had a fish fry, the community would helping you get it all together. Yeah. We want to help because it is big. I mean, we I do think have the sooner the better. Yeah. And for the, and for the, as as the can, last yeah. years, that has been lack of people are biting yeah. at the bit to start having that re re resume. 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 So the more of a priority to have a fish fry than getting us trained. No, 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 that's got nothing that's, to do with it. That's what we're trying to do is get people trained, get yeah, the trucks back going. The fish fry is in the be building. Ready isn't going to gonna... have a fish fry by April. Right, yeah. 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 Well, would your training have anything to do with the fish fry? Yeah, exactly. Because we're trying to understand that. We only have a certain amount of days, like on the weekends, that we can get everybody trained. So, like, right now we're into February. We're getting our CPRs and stuff in. Well, none of that was ones. said. But so now we know why we can't I'm, do yeah, it. Yeah, because we're limited. And, you know, a lot of our volunteers, we all work. So we have to do it on our off days and yeah. stuff. So we're trying to fit everything in. We've got a cascade system that we're worried about. Um, trucks we're worried about. We have boot repairs that we have to do because of the former fire department. So 
it is no service. No, we understand, you know, besides they just don't want to do it. That's what it sounded like, you know. Right. Plus now we, we know why. We have to clean the firehouse from you know yeah. come on now, we, we do have to clean the firehouse. The next plan fish fry is February twenty second at the Lutheran Church. School. All right. Through the fish fryers, I know that. So. And actually, half the fish fryers that are on fish fryers is on the fire department. So that's not a problem. We got people to help fry. But yeah, but we will need rudders when we uh, are ready. We need rudders, so the servers. If you get it out to the public, you'll have people in here that's willing to help and get this thing rolling. It's a one-day event. We get the community back together. Uh, trying to get the community back together as quick as you can to let them know that you are sincere about putting it back together quicker. It's a one-day event. It's not that hard. Everybody's it's not a one-day event. It huh? takes you guys two days to prepare for it, then you have it. But what are you saying it's a one-day event for? Saturday. No, she's up here bread and fish the two days before the thing and peeling potatoes and all that. Why do you say it's a no, one-day event? No, we buy all the potatoes. Though. That's all bought. So the, only thing, the only thing we got to do when we do a fry is have the building clean. And then Friday night, you get the tartar sauce together. And then, and the uh, coleslaw. And yeah, the you take it back to your, your members. Okay. It's two day, no matter well, we, the minimum. Like it's a two day one. event for the fire. Okay. Well, it's less than Can you decide to let us know, please? Please. Okay. I mean, I'd like to see what you know. I know you want to wait until October. Right, right. February is very busy for us right now. You know, I need to get the CPR done. Let's get to by the end of February, let us let us know what's going on. Okay, I'd like to see one. I'm sure the community would like to see one, but I want everybody on the same side. And I mean, I I'm not trying to run the meeting either. So <laughs> let us know on that, okay, please. So we'll just table it until next time. Also, you can get community service members or jail workers. I don't have a problem with getting them to come over. I know people have complained in the past. They stay in the back, they wash dishes, they, they need that services, they're big help, they're trusted ones, you know, yeah, if we need somebody, go pick them up, I can help go pick them up. Okay, so what you're saying February 22nd at Lutheran Church there on 10th in Jackson, correct? Yeah, school. I think they're going to have a drive through They will have a drive through Okay, is that going to be for Sanfair Fire Department? No, 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 that's, that's the fish, we're just saying that's the first Friday of the year. Oh, okay, okay. As a fish fryer, we're speaking. Okay, gotcha. Is it okay if I post in the newspaper asking for dates on Monday? Yeah, that needs to be done. Probably the last part of February, so by Monday we have a meeting in March. That would be done in April. Okay, it's in September. Can I ask them what about if something was organized? Um, with the old San Pierre school, that church there, for a fish fry. Yeah, they have no does. way of doing it over they there. They don't? They, don't they have no refrigeration. Okay. There's no kitchen and, there. And they've turned that whole gymnasium into the church. Okay. We, we've talked about that before. There's no way of doing one there because of the health issues with refrigeration. Okay, so any place that the fish fryers go to, they have to... They have to have refrigeration. We need a full <laughs> okay. And since it's a separate entity, we, as fish fryers, hey, you're a fish fryer, right? Bart, you're a fish fryer? Yes, he is. So we're, we're all fish fryers. fryers. Fish fryers. <laughs> we're not part of San Fair Fire Department. Right. We can have one board member that is part of San Fair Fire Department. Right. Uh, the rules. But neither none of us are. And they hire us for fundraisers to make money like the junior class and the church right it's so we like when we come to us you know and right. ask for the fundraiser and then we put it into our schedule um, like St. Pierre be hiring us like Judson does so it's right. all separate now so, so there are people doing fundraisers you know they can contact like Mike's in charge of fish fries so would you like me to uh, put this on the concerned citizen page or do I have to talk to Mike? About what? February 22nd, fish fry. Mike's got, Mike's got that taken. 
church she, got to take she, care of it. The church yeah. did, but if she she can put that on, she can go ahead and put it on. Yeah. It's not, it's not going to hurt a thing. So they have a for It's already yeah. Yeah. So that's 4 p.m. until, right? Right. They always do extra fish for another church over at Wheatfield. You know, Don Lukey comes and pays for it all and takes it over. They have their own fish fry, do their own sides. So it's, it's all a fundraiser. All the money goes to the Lutheran Church, their account. Uh, do you sure know what the price going. of the tickets are? Pardon? The you price of the tickets? tickets? They're, they'll stay the same, I'm sure. They don't know for sure. Twelve? Ten. Ten, ten and five. So. Ten adults and five for children? Yeah. That's the way it's always been. We, okay. Just checking to make sure. Well, you have to double check with Mike, make sure yeah. it hasn't changed. But that's the way it's always been. Okay. Yeah, they've had a really good turnout at the church in the last few years. With the fire not firehouse not having them, it, yeah, people were going. And they should have upped it 100 pounds or 80 pounds, whatever they said. But they're going to. They did. They did last year. They'll do it again this year. Yeah, the more people, the better. So, more questions. Anybody else got any questions of any kind <coughs> for the board or for me or anything? Okay. Right, right now, how many brush trucks do we have? Or is Judson helping with brush fire? We have two brush trucks two right now. But as far as I'm concerned, that Dodge in the back. It's got tranny issues. It's got tranny issues. So we and, uh, I'm scared to take take that truck out and put any of my guys in that truck. If you're in the middle of a woods fire, it's don't not, even, don't even attempt it. Just get, put it out, look up at Mary, get it out of its misery and get it out of here. Were we using Wheatfield's first truck before? No, Wheatfield took them back. After. Maybe they would let us use it again? I think they've uh, no. already put them. Yeah, um, they got there's uses one already, for them I think, already. back to a fire truck and one for one of the cemeteries for watering the flowers and yeah. stuff like that. One to basically a spare. Fire truck. Yeah. Put a list together of what you need, like a brush truck and anything else. We did order the gloves. The gloves and stuff are coming to you guys. And then the cascade machine, which is over here, there is a guy coming to fix that. And so uh, he was here ready and looked at it, and it's a compressor. And that's $5,000 to fix that. Well, it's not going to be fixed. It's taking no. it Right, right. And anyway, to get it back going, another one going five grand. I've got, like I say, your gloves and your hats ordered. And the place we're dealing with, they have Chad's number, so if Chad orders anything, that's fine. You know, because I'm not worried about you're not going to over order, over buy anything. My concern with it is having enough stuff for everybody to be protected in here. But get me a list together, if you would. Is there a price cut off so we know um, of what kind of equipment we're asking for? Yeah, yeah you can you put put down what you ask for, and then the board will decide, you know, if we can do it or what we can do. I mean, you can ask for all kinds of stuff, but we'll decide. Okay. So, and, and it'll be to reasonable. Me, to me, to me, it sounds like right now probably a brush truck would be a smart move. To Any ask more for. equipment? Our turnout gear, Chad. Uh, turnout gear, we're going to have to look at to see date wise. We have some new new turnout gear, but as you go through the years, it's only good for so long. It needs to be updated. Has to be, good for it has to be okay. updated. We'll put, just get that all written up and give it to me. Okay, please. I'm just going to put that truck down at Boyd Cross because they can save the skid plate in the back, probably. Okay. Could, could we take that to public auction or make a motion? Okay. Get rid of it so we don't have junk sitting down there. Or maybe to clear everybody's mind, can we get rid of that lawnmower? Just take it to an auction and say, hey, see what we did? Yeah. Then everything would be. Yep. If it's junk, it's junk. Yeah. I don't find. As a board member, I don't want to spend money on junk. Right. If we're going to need to get a truck, we're going to need to get a truck. Just get a copy so. Yeah. So take the skid out of it, drain it down, it's drained. Can that be stored out there at the yeah. This kid can't be. I don't know what's out there. I've never been out there. Just a Jeep. Just a Jeep. 
Transmission issues, as is, there is. I, I do have a concern, though, for township property. Yeah. So, back when we had our one snowfall, um, we've uh, seen tracks going in because we were out on call. We've seen tracks going in Holy Cross because it was already late at night. And come to find out, we had a citizen uh, joyriding back there doing donuts. Cascade system on six. When the gentleman was here, looked at the, the cascade system over here in the belt in the <coughs> cabinet here. He also looked at six. Six is okay, but he took a sample of the air and he sent it out to Texas. And that was a week ago, Thursday. He's looking at a minimum of two weeks before you get the results back on the air in the six, whether or not it's good or bad. So the unit itself is good, but the air sample is not back here yet. They're going to call Chad when the sample comes back and whether or not the air in six is good. Because when we looked at, I was here with the man when he looked at the cascade system here in the cabinet. Somebody had taken that thing apart and there is a charcoal filter that goes in the canister to purify the air. Well, the canister is not in that unit. So we don't know how long even if any air was pumped with the canister filter being gone. So therefore, the three tanks that's on the canister or the cascade system here in the storage building has to be taken off, sent back to Monon, and we recertify them tanks. Because at this point in time, we don't know what kind of air is in them tanks. At this point, we do not know what kind of air is in the tanks in six until the sample comes back from Texas. But the unit itself is okay in six waiting on a sample to come back. I did not have the guy take a sample in six or in cascade unit here because the filter was gone. I told him don't even spend a hundred dollars and worry about that. Pull the tanks off, get them certified, <coughs> scratch on that. There was no sense wasting any money since the canister is gone, the filter is gone. Without the charcoal filter in there, don't know if the tank was filled with off the filter or whether or not the filter was pulled off because the unit was down. When's the last time those were checked? 2016. 1 to 16, Chad. So those tanks need to be unbolted, and AAA's got to be called and pick them up, get them recertified. So get them back here. So when that unit shows up, the tanks are here, ready to slap on, and you're ready to go. 